welcome to Razzle Dazzle Mania 2. This will be the greatest event since Razzle Dazzle Mania 1. Have a nice day. I'm coming home. It comes on and makes me feel strong. I thought I told you that we won't stop till we back cruising through Harlem, these old blocks. For all of my shortcomings, welcome to my homecoming. Yeah, it's been a long time coming. I'm coming you are. Home. Are you ready? Hey, think you can tell us what to do? You think you could tell us what to wear? Are you ready? No, no, no! Razzle Dazzle Mania! I said, are you ready? Then, for the three people in attendance, and the millions watching at home, live on YouTube, and for Scott Hall, the despicable, pulsating, bloated, festering, Sweaty, pus filled, mart foamed box. Let's get ready to suck all these at home. Ready or not, here I am. This is Jam Dango of the POE. Just so you know, although I've been away for a few months, I will be back after I film, finish filming my f new film with Halle Berry and finishing my first ever album featuring Skylar Grey. And I'm coming for the POE title. Time to play the game! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna make a major announcement about the Hall of Fame. We have a celebrity wing now. And in that wing will be the first inductee. No one cares what he wants to say. This guy. Dude, you're on your own. Mark's a real professional. He asked me for some advice. I said, Mark, just do it from the heart. An actor uh, uses a part to work out uh, <laughs> his own mythology or her own mythology. I think Mark Ruffalo overall raised the bar for all the guys and girls in the back. Mark Ruffalo really changed the game in this business. If it wasn't for him, I don't know where we'd be. It's very humbling. Um, I don't really belong up here <laughs> uh, with uh, 
these people who have done so so much over so many years. Um, it's a it's a it's a great honor. Um, I can only accept this award by acknowledging that it must be shared with hundreds of thousands of other people throughout the United States. And I, and I also must use this moment to remind people and President Obama, uh, I humbly accept this award for the fight that I think will define my generation and many to come. Thank you very much for this deeply, deeply um, gratifying honor. I appreciate it. And thank you for, for staying to the wee hours of the morning to celebrate this. Thank you. Blessings. Dazzlemania 2, the end will come. For Doc. He caused me so many problems. It's time I cause him a few. Get out here, Wolfman! Do this thing! Insane wolf man. I had to go and find the Tibetan fighting monks. They sorted me out. They got rid of most of my insanity. But I saved one little bit of insanity for you. Doc. Yeah. This one is gonna really hurt. This one is gonna spell the end for you. Doc. That's right. Ha <laughs> ha! Ah! <laughs> yeah! Okay, okay, now that I've destroyed your chance of having any wolf cubs, it's time to find out who you really are! <laughs> oh my, oh my, it's, it's, it's Wolfman. There's only one person that can referee this match. It's the streak for the sponsor off championship. Introducing the challenger first, Joseph Wolf. Owen oh, Hassan. Harry Finnegan. Hall of Famer. Congratulations. <laughs> now, time to bring out my opponent. It's the un American Bad Ape. An American body. Who the hell is this guy? Hello. That's right. I, you're calling me, and I've got the greatest, um, most up to date Samsung Galaxy S3 phone. What? It's 8:25. I'm waiting for the sponsor off.
finally here. Well, these are kind enough to arrive on American Bad Ape. Okay guys, I want a good clean match here. If you want, touch gloves and then start. After me? Alright. After you indeed, yes. Alright, thanks. Well, I've got here today, between the, the, the mode of transportation that I actually came here on, is a skateboard from Blind Death Squad. You can use it to ride on, so you get like less exercise. It's pretty nifty. I know it says you're trying to say it's blind, but I'm wearing glasses and I can't really see it because it seems to me like it's upside down. But that's we need to get a sponsor off underway. So uh, you talk about being lazy and all this sort of stuff. Joseph Wolf is all about the exercise, doing a hard day's work. Like a, like a man, you know? So if you need an energy boost, help yourself to some Red Rooster. Well, if you want to get your energy that way, then that's fine. But I've got here a nice VHS tape when you just want to go lounge around. And of course, this is also going to be the future, so make sure you get your VHS Future Proof Tapes. I, I can't compete with that. It's a high resolution VHS tape. That is remarkable. But after all of the running about, sweating because you're, you're on your skateboard after your energy boost, you need to smell good. So. With a little help from this, fuck me, you smell good. Well, I guess everybody wants to smell nice from time to time, I suppose, so can't fault you there. But if you want to be in for some creativity, then why don't you get yourself the Fire Emblem Awakening art book? You get to see tons of art just to inspire you to draw. Art? Right. Just throw me a frickin' bone here. Well, jokes aside, why have a why have a frickin' bone when you can be dead as a ghost? A very buddy ghost. You could even use him as a stress ball. But why not just look in the mirror and wish you were also dead? That's going to be a tough one to beat, Joseph. Uh, I've watched the sponsor of videotapes or DVD recordings or whatever <laughs> kids are calling it these days, but I've watched every one of them and every time, are you always joking about? I don't know what it is with yourself, but how you keep that streak alive because you always joke about it is beyond me. But I've, my friends and my lawyers down at Wolf 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 have found the kryptonite to your streak. And that, my friend, oh yeah, is a boofle. No, not the boofle! <laughs> ah, ah! Okay, uh, I won! <laughs> I won! Can't believe it! I won again! Let me tell you something, dudes. That Paul Heisenberg, Rowdy Roddy Piper, whatever the f he's called, dude, he's got no chance, brother, because I've been watching the Mania WrestleMania, I was watching the story of WrestleMania, I just watched WrestleMania, so he's got no chance in hell of beating me. So what you gonna do, brother? 
when Hulkamania comes wild. Save the POE from Hulk Hogan. Fuck, he's getting up. He's getting up quick. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here.